Welcome back one and all to Corporate Espionage Part 3-ish, I think? We are at the top floor of the office now. It's time to kind of just open the door, see what's going on in here. Nothing, we're just gonna kind of... Get some cover, a little bit of cover. For everybody, I guess. There's going to be some significant hacking in here, as well as some... Um, Gun fighting, of course, because gun fighting is important. This game is 99% about gun fighting. That's, well, maybe a little bit of an exaggeration. Maybe 95% about gun fighting. And then like 4% hacking. No, I'm just kidding. It's not quite. It's like 70% uh, gun fighting, maybe 15% hacking, 50% more. Something along those lines. It's a good game, though. I like it. I like it a lot. It's my least favorite of the Shadowrun. Quartet, I guess there's no, there's four of them, I think. Let's see, there's this one, the Shadowrun Returns, there's uh, Dragonfall, there's Tokyo something, and there's Boston Lockdown, so there's, yeah. Although I haven't played Boston Lockdown yet, so. Anybody in here? No, shockingly not. Alright. Go grab some cover. You are not the hacker. You can go to the computer, but don't turn it on yet. I think once we turn it on, bad things start to happen. So there's a thing. What are you? It's a glowy. This globe glows with an unearthly light. The areas around Tier Tin Gear and did fade it away before I got the rest of it. Can I not look at it again? I went too fast. You have to read the rest of it on your own. Let's go hide. No, wrong person. It doesn't offer any cover. Uh, you're not really great at long range, so actually you should move right here somewhere. You can get into position to hack, like here. And you are going to hide. There's something extremely loud happening outside just a second ago. That's oh, a motorcycle. Of course it is. You're gonna go hide here behind this desk to guard our hacker. You go here. You're fine. Our troll needs a better spot to set up or to stand, I should say. Maybe like right here, right around the corner. No real cover, but good enough. Uh, you. Hack clock. Yeah, that looks fine with me. And you guys do nothing. All right, Dodger. Let's go in. Cam node one. All right, let's turn that on. Oh, frick. That was dumb of me. All right, let's get a attacker program out. Then we will blast one of them. His accuracy isn't actually the best for a hacker that I've ever seen, but he can also heal himself. Which might be a good choice. Oh, go away, motorcycle, and nobody cares. Stop hitting my main character, he's gonna, or my guy, he's gonna die. Uh, let's try and degrade this one. Unfortunate. I'm hoping that we can finish these two off before one of them kills me. Yay, we did it. Okay, good. Hello, random person that just walked into the office. And you are going to go here. Prepare to go into the next room. Need him to heal first, though. He's a little bit hurt. A little bit too hurt to go into the next room. Don't want him to die. That is actually a game over if that happens. Okay, looks like we're free and clear in there for now. Oh, we have a box. I'm gonna 
heal again. No, two more turns. Great. Oh man, come on guys. Oh, he just what died? Or did he die? No, he's okay. Um, he needs to heal again though. There's another dude there. Good shot. I'm actually a little bit impressed with her. more guys show up, we'll take care of them. There's more coming through, including a big troll looking guy and more people now. Good. Can we heal? No. Uh, we need our program to go first. We're also down one AP this round because of reasons. We can't go through that door. Oh, frick, there's another box. Oh, wait, we didn't actually kill that box. That was dumb. I'm glad he didn't kill us. Clearly, I'm not on my A game today. Right. Can go through here. So you can go through, but the program can't. Oh no, again now. Note of concern node. Local files search results for Project Aegis. Title: Security Threat Assessment. Lynn Telestrian. At this point, we cannot confidently assign a motive to Miss Telestrian's hiring of Shadowrunners to destroy the company's Columbia River facility. But there are two leading contenders. The most likely is she is working for a rival megacorp, seeking a competitive advantage. But an alternate expl explanation is that it has something to do with her deep involvement with the Universal Brotherhood. Interesting. While Telestrian Industries, of course, would never interfere with an employee's religious choices, our 2053 investigation raised concerns that Miss Telestrian's devotion to the cult like Universal Brotherhood could represent a security risk to the company, and it is possible that this has become true. I would like to leave, please, but no. You have to actually leave the area, leave the teleporter zone before going back through, it looks like. Annoying, but okay. Um, anybody else in here? Yeah, there's several people coming. We know that. So let's just go camp out behind a sofa. A sofa chair. And uh, do overwatch. So we'll just wait. You can also move behind a chair. And you will move behind the sofa itself. Done. I would like to thank you all for joining me. It will be a terrible, terrible thing for you, but, you know, things happen. Alright, there's a box right in front of us. Let's degrade that. He actually did it. Oh. Frickin' A, really? It's taking a lot of healing. You are right beside it, all you need to do is hit it once. Okay, that's, that's not okay. Looks like a couple more are on their way over. Alright, so we have a 45% chance of hitting that one. Let's just uh, hide in cover here. We can try and degrade that one. Cool, it actually worked. And hit it. It actually did work. Cool. A little bit of cover won't. Although well, we can't cover from the other side, but that's way further away, so it has a much lower chance of hitting us. Now we have many enemies. Heavy gunner, I think, first. And then the adept can just take a hot shot. No crit, but pretty decent damage nonetheless. Yes. Hit. Time for double shotty to the chest. Or a single shotty that kills her. You know what? I'm perfectly okay with that. Those two of the enemies that were coming in, dead and gone. Alright, so. 
the that one, I think. Cool. One more hit. Oh, it's not line of sighted. So. Yay, you hit! Oh, you actually hit me. Wasn't actually expecting that. Shield, incoming damage lowered. Fine. Yay, killed that one. One more. Yay, we only have that one left. You go hide. And just wait for your heal to come back up. You move up to fight. No one else came through the door, so we're just gonna reload and wait. One more turn till we can heal again. I'm glad that our program seems to be pretty hard to hit. Because otherwise it would be just us in here. Actually we have other programs we can summon, but... Cool. Now we can get the personal comm logs notes. Or notes. Phone VM search results for Project Aegis. Call from Thomas Telestrian. Recorded five days ago. Dad, it's all gone. The runners attacked last night and managed to blow up the whole damn Columbia River facility to bits. I've had teams sorting through the rubble all morning, and they haven't found a single viable Project Aegis material. The sample I sent you is all that's left. This is a mess. Lots of people dead, and the building is a total loss. Call me to discuss what you want to do next, Tom. Alright. So we blew up the facility. Good. They deserved it. Thanks. I'm just so angry today. So grouchy. Uh, we're not going to go through first. We're going to let our program go through first. It's a good way to die going through first. Do you healing yet? No. And turn. Still nobody in here. Oh, there they come. They were waiting, apparently. And now they are going to die. Anybody home? Nobody yet. There's one guy down there. It's a long ways away though. Heal up our program to make sure it doesn't die on us. Move up a little bit. Uh, there's one, two, three guys. Okay, well they've seen us. Hopefully they'll come after us. Don't want to go out there to fight all of them at once. Apparently doing something. Oh, there's more of them back there. Oh, that sucks. How could? What is my chance? I have 43% chance to hit, which means I would never hit a thousand years. Let's try and get a disintegration on it. Good, it's vulnerable. And I'm just gonna back you up a little bit. And you can't hit from there, but that's okay. This program can, and you are going to make a firewall. Right here, 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 here. All right, let's take care of these guards again. Oh, wrong gun type or one wrong shot type. Oh, these guys are weak. Alright, problem solved. You back up, let them come to us. You heal again yet? Next turn. Nope, can't shoot that one yet. Might as well heal then. Oh, 
Hey, there's that guy. Alright, we can blow some of them up. We have that, uh... Not firewall. The other one, blaster. Surprised he actually pulled that off. Alright, moving up. Let's see what else there is in here. Uh, there's nobody in here. They're gonna be fighting us yet, anyways. So let's move our guy up to the cover. Oh, there's a deadly one. The black ICs. Not in range. No, I didn't. Why would you move the screen? Ugh. Oh well, it's fine. Everything's awesome. It's okay. I missed. That's not the worst thing ever. That kind of sucked though. And we did it. Another personal correspondent node. A little doo doo sound means that we can safely move around this area. Email and IM search results for Project Aegis. Sample security from E Silver Star at Telestrian UCAS. Mr. Telestrian, in light of the remaining recent attack, I have relocated the only remaining sample of Project Aegis to the safe in my office. The safe is hidden, and the safe's lock is mechanical, and thus not at risk from major sticker attacks. Sincerely, Eric Silverstar, Director of Security, Telestrian Industries, Seattle office. Well done, Monami. As it happens, Eric Silverstar's office is on this very floor. What time a good little a little good fortune came our way, huh? You know, it's almost like things are going according to plan, as you say. Now, to stop those elevators, I'm sure there's an accessible node in this system. We can access, find it before you're overrun with guards. I'm working on that. You could actually help, you know, shut down things. Okay. There's no enemies out here yet. We don't need to reload, so... You are going through first. Hello, enemies. There's one Orby. One Orby's not so bad. Especially if we actually hit it. Holy crap, we actually hit it twice. Oh shit! This is not good. Right. Let's move, first of all. First things first, moving out of direct line of fire. Second. Blaster. Oh uh, yeah. Killed our own program. That was stupid. Let me. We have more programs though. Exploder program might help. Have moved and blue or blown up. That was dumb. Ow. Jesus, that hurt. And that's it, we are dead. But we can go back in. But it's a long, long walk back. <laughs> oh hey, they moved the defenders over here. Super. Well, 
that takes some of the edge off. They're not gonna move. We need to try and kill them. Nope. And rather try and kill that one. Yay, we killed the deadly one. Also, they do shit tons of damage. God damn it, are you serious? That might actually kill our hacker. Straight up. Who has a healing kit? Trauma kit. There we go. He's back. I need someone to come heal him now. Fine. I know you can't reach him, just let me unselect the thing that I'm trying to do here. Also, what time are we at on this video? We're 21 minutes, we should probably end it here, but we'll do it as soon as we can go up. And we'll finish up our hacking next time. Freaking ridiculous, though. All right, we're good. We're going back in. And that's going to be the end of our video. Stupid hacking, I hate. It's much easier in Dragonfall. We're gonna kill these guys before we end the video, actually. Because I'm annoyed at them. Very annoyed at them, actually. They're both there. Probably going to heal. And then do their like extremely high attacks. Missed though. Nice. That actually helps us out. Okay, go through. Where'd they go? Oh, they're, they teleported behind us. Super. These are actually other deckers, that's why they're so hard to kill. Why do they get instant heals? Also, that one's not even in an area. Let's go hide and get another program out and heal. I don't think that one can move. I think he's actually stuck. Alrighty, let's heal up. Apparently, Telestrian security deckers are very good. Nice. Let's go blow him up. If we're only fighting one, it's not a big deal. Oh, fuck off with this one. Seriously. Okay, let's move up. We're going to try and degrade this guy. You didn't do very good in school. Not degrading. Hit. Two hits. Finally, we killed one of the Telestrian security guys. And we're gonna kill him, kill the other one, hopefully. I think. I like how he's stuck there in nowhere land. Uh, let's not do that. We'll blow up the wrong guy. Oh, we actually got him with Vulnerable. Nice. Wasn't expecting to. 
Low chance of that. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Missed. Good. Heal himself, of course, because why not? There we go. Now he's dead. Maybe we can quickly do our hacking. We'll, we'll make this video a teensy bit longer than normal. All I want to do is get this thing, this hack done with. Do the elevator and get out of here. We've killed all the Telestrian security, which is nice. Hoping the boxes will all die. They did Ow. Sweet and miss. Okay, we need our last bot for sure. We can't AoE. We have two moves left. Good. That actually worked really, really well. Shield bot, shield me. Oh, that worked out okay. Oof. All right, we got the little sound. That means we're good. Finally, let's open the elevator. Uh, we can't move until the firewall is done. Good. Okay, time to do this thing, and then we're done. We got control of the elevators. And we're now officially out of combat, actually. Time to leave. Unfortunately, they don't give you a shortcut out of here. You actually have to walk all the way back, which is a little miffing. It's not too, too bad, but it's just kind of something to be improved upon in later iterations. Like, just a, like, jack out button would be nice somewhere. Yes, there is one. What's this button do? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe you can just do that. Go away. Nope. Doesn't do anything. I don't even know what it's supposed to do. That's okay, we're almost out of here. It must suck to be a hacker, because like, your brain gets turned to mush and you get hit in here, and then you end up dying horribly. We're almost out though. And then we're done, or whatever it is, and we're up. Cool. So that's going to be the end of our video. In the next video we'll finish up this place and move on to the next part of the story. We are just closing in sort of on the end edition of this game. Like always, if you have any suggestions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise I'll see you guys next time. Take care.